All right, welcome everybody. It's me, KB, and uh, today's video is not going to be any helpful, but uh, you know, in my last video about Android 10 on PC, I made a promise that I'm going to make a full tutorial on how to install Android 10 on PC. So, you know, sadly, we have a sad news for that tutorial because there is a big, big, big problem with that tutorial, <laughs> or you can say Android 10 for PC, okay? So, let me show you. I'm going to boot my Android 10 from USB in my i5. Actually, you cannot see the number, but the PC I'm using right now is a i5 8 gigabyte of ram it's pretty good you know it's it's a good pc for low end os like android linux even for windows okay it's a i5 and 8 gigabyte of ram but the problem is that this pc cannot even run the android 10 yes i'm just gonna run the live cd just to show you guys that it just reboots itself okay it doesn't go any further so actually i was making a tutorial i was at the middle of the tutorial and i installed and i did everything but it did not boot up so i'm going to show you right here in my i5 pc it's not booting up but in my i7 it's booting up so you know i don't know if the requirements are higher for android 10 or maybe because this is in alpha build the bliss os 12 aka android 10 maybe that's why you can see it just didn't boot up it just went black and it's gonna boot up again to the usb and it's gonna do the same thing again and again okay so I'm going to show you in my i7 that I can actually boot up. All right, this is my second PC laptop actually. So I'm going to boot up the Android 10 here. Okay. Uh, let me, yeah, USB storage. I'm going to hit enter. All right. So let it boot up. Uh, actually, I'm going to run the live CD. Okay, come on, focus, man. All right. So I'm going to run the live CD here without installation and you will see that the live CD will run actually and I will be able to use the Android 10 in my i7 laptop but not in my i5 okay so that's the problem and I don't want to install the Android 10 in my i7 because that's my main PC and I don't want to mess up I can do the dual boot I can still do the tutorial but since the requirements are really high okay for the android 10 aka bliss os 12 or maybe because it's in alpha build that's why it's not not working in my iFi laptop so yeah i'm i'm just you know as i said i was making a tutorial as i promised but the problem is here that i can't even boot in my i5 you can see how fast it booted up you know everything works all right so it's not like even the wi-fi works all right you can see wi-fi is working oh what so <laughs> so what i mean is that um i'm gonna wait for the another build which might have less requirements like four gigabyte of ram at least it would run on i3 or i7 okay i5 actually so in my i7 uh, i7 you can see intel i7 it's running perfectly fine and i believe i can also install it in my i7 laptop but in my i5 i cannot so yeah sorry for this because i made a promise about I would make a tutorial on how to install Android 10 on PC but the problem here is that the requirements are really high and I think this will be really 
unuseful video for anyone who is looking for Android 10 for PC. But uh, even though if you still believe that you want to install, I mean not believe, you just want to install Android 10 on your PC, then uh, there are many tutorials online uh, actually how to install Android. So it doesn't have to be specific Android 10. So the installation for any Android on PC is same okay find a good tutorial which shows you how to install android 10 actually i have an idea i'm gonna put a link in the description for a one good tutorial where he shows how to install android 8 but as i said the installation for android is same on pc you have to do the same thing okay so it doesn't matter my tutorial you may have to wait a little longer because I believe Android 10 should not require a CPU higher than like i3. It should even run on duo processor or something like that, okay? Because it's kind of a Linux and you know Android and Linux are lightweight operating system. I don't know about the Android 10 anymore because <laughs> as I said it's not booting up in my i5 laptop but it is booting successfully in my um, i7 laptop so yeah you got the idea i don't want to talk too much and uh, yeah that's it this is a side video because i will uh, i can't make a tutorial on android 10 i feel really sad but uh, what to do just gonna wait for next release for the bliss os so maybe that will fix the problem with the i5 or i3 thingy for now if you are interested you can still install it on um i7 above laptops okay maybe it will also work on i5 but just in my case you know i have a really good laptop i5 is a good laptop and i have a 8 gigabyte of ram which is a good thing and i have a one terabyte of uh hsd uh, you know story hard disk and yeah the problem is that i can't even do the live boot in my pc which means there is something wrong okay which means it requires a higher cpu so that's all i mean okay so you saw the thing that i cannot boot up so yeah i don't want to talk too much i'm just gonna put a good video link in the description which shows you how to install android on your PC and you can watch that and if you are interested you can install it on your i7 above PC yeah that's it hope you guys understand me okay I will see you in the next one take care yourself have fun bye bye